I am stepping out of Matampi today. The press don't need to come to the airport again. We have an express uh, our state house. Uh, so uh, I'm stepping out for uh, the United Nations session. I'm speaking on behalf of our uh, people, our country, on uh, a little after 12 o'clock on Friday, uh, U.S. time. I think our time was Saturday. I'm not too sure, but Friday, U.S. time, uh, I, I will once again be addressing matters pertaining to PMD stress. And uh, we'll be speaking this time around on human rights, uh, uh, preservation of individual uh, human rights, the context of uh, uh, God given freedom. We also have advocated continually on uh, our view that our resources, especially our forest resource and our biodiversity and our marine resources, have not been given to you, you uh, value in the entire conversation on, on uh, climate change and climate change mitigations. Uh, the global funds available for climate change mitigations, Papua New Guinea Grand Chief was the leader I had of every other community. Article 6 of, of the Paris Accord uh, was a draft from uh, our country, uh, Grand Chief Sumara at the time, early 2000s, was a great mover and uh, we contributed that to that simply means forest resource owners must be given uh, value for forest conservation. Uh, instead of harvesting forests to deplete, uh, what could be a uh, resource that could be sustained for eaten generations? Uh, and so that conversation is not really uh, had clearly. Uh, and out of frustration, we did indicate we might not attend COP29 this year and protest of the fact that our forest values are not adequately uh, compensated for, for the carbon sink propensity as well as the, the, the balance of the ecosystem and atmosphere with respect to the role they play for these obstacles. So those conversations will be, will be uh, uttered at the United Nations Forum. Uh, of course, our response to uh, our, our particular pledge to deliver to the SDG Environments in the 2030 agenda of the United Nations. So, uh, your would be again uh, once uh, delivered our nation speech. Last year, uh, my brother here had the honor of representing our country in many work in the world today, back and forth. Uh, this year, he will represent our country in APEC, uh, as I do to uh, the United Nations this year. So, that is all for me. I'm stepping out. I'll be back on the 1st of uh, October. It's a sort of quick trip, uh, just make transition, uh, go there, deliver the sweets on, on Friday, uh, take rest on Saturday, and Saturday evening, that's just like next week. Uh, so, I want to communicate to our country, uh, the Deputy Prime Minister, we have the Prime Minister, Acting Prime Minister in charge, which uh, continue the administration of our executive government.